Hi guys, so today is going to be a very special collab video with um, my BFF, Claire Gray. Um, today is our birthday. Um, we were both born September 3rd. And what we've decided, I've been a little down in the weather because if you follow me on social media, you'll know August 3rd, I lost my, my best buddy. Um, and I was trying to take him to the hospital to actually have him put down because I found him in a pile or not a pile, a puddle of his fluid. Um, he had pleural effusion and pulmonary edema and he had stopped wanting to take his pill and stopped wanting to eat, which should have been a sign right there that, you know, he's declining. But you always hope for the best when it's your pet, especially when you love him so much. He was my buddy. He went everywhere with me. Um, he went to the store. He went just for rides. No matter where I had to go, he went in the car. He was the type that I always had to worry about stepping down off of a couch or my bed because he was always there. He sat underneath the kitchen table by me. He just, he was my buddy. And sadly, 10 minutes before I got to the hospital, he passed on me. So I took it pretty hard and, you know, I, I still kind of am. And now today being the one month anniversary kind of puts my birthday in a different perspective. So Claire, in an attempt to cheer me up, said, why don't we do a collab? So this collab is five green and five blue um, fall polishes. And I'm going to think I'm doing something different this time. Usually I pick out ones that I've worn already, but this one I'm going to use ones that I haven't worn and will hopefully try to break out for the fall. So with that being said, happy birthday, Claire. Um, the trying times I couldn't have gotten through without you. So, um, I thank you. And Let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so first one up here. Some of these need to be shook because I've not worn them. This is a Wet n Wild Mega Last and this is I Moss Have It. And it is a murky green with some gold shimmers in there. I don't know how to describe colors. You all should know that by now. Just look at the pretty colors. <laughs> okay, so there it is on the brush. Okay, so I will do as usual one coat on the wheel and then I will pause and do the second coats. So here is one coat of I Must Have It if I can get my hand out of the way. Okay, so it is a little streaky on the first coat, but it should um, deepen up on the second. All right, so the next one I have, this is, oh, and these need to be, like I need to put these in my shaker for an hour. This is a Barrielle. And this is in the color of Holiday Madness, which is soon coming around. And it's, again, it's another murky, murky green. But they're still, they're murky, but they have a brightness to them. So there's Holiday Madness. And here is one coat on the swatch. And it's in kind of like, um blue typed base like it's um like a not a blackened base but like a blued base i guess i don't know whatever next one up this one is really sheer 
really, really sheer. I'm going to spend a second here shaking it because maybe I just never had it shook up enough. I got this on clearance at a Dollar General, which is amazing. I've never seen it before. This is a Broadway gel. And it's in the color Gatsby. And it's just a beautiful green. Like, I, I can't describe this green. It's a different tone green. I don't know, but it's pretty. It's coming up brighter on camera. And you could just see how sheer that is. And I'm not one that minds doing, like, four coats. I will go four coats. I won't go anything more than that, though. Um... So I will work with it if it's a pretty color. And this, I believe, is a pretty color. So I will work with this. I will just show you, guys, two coats on the wheel. Um, but there that is. And you can see it is extremely sheer. But that shimmer is just gorgeous. So even if you wanted to use this as a topper over something, you very well could. Okay, next up is um, a pretty new acquisition for me from Zoya. And this is called Apple. And it's a very beautiful green with a shimmer in it. Obviously, it's green. Beautiful gold glass flex. So here is the first coat of Apple. And I think this is pretty sheer also. So this one might be a three coater. Again, I'm only going to show two. I top out at two on my swatches online or on video. And next one up is also new. And I have a feeling a lot of people are going to be getting this. I know Claire did. And this is China Glaze Baroque Jungle. And it's a beautiful, deep, deep green with a beautiful shimmer. Shimmer is noticeable on the nail. So here is one coat of Baroque Jungle. Great formula as usual. Okay, so there is one coat. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead into the blues now. I did greens because green is Claire's favorite color. I did them first for that reason. First one up, I know a lot of people own. I got rid of Blue by You by Sinful Colors because this is a dupe for that. And this is Orly's Royal Navy. It's a beautiful deep blue with a green, a turquoisey colored shimmer. And there it is on the brush. And again, these are polishes I've never worn and hope to break out sometime in the fall months, but we'll see. I'm so indecisive when it comes to that. I kind of pick my polishes for the day on a whim. Gotta be feeling the color that day for some reason. So we'll see. Okay, so here is the first coat of Royal Navy. Next up is a fairly new Sinful Colors. Um, I don't know if anybody's going to be able to find this if you don't have it. Anything I can find online that's still available, I'll link down below. With um, More than likely, if it's from Amazon, it's an affiliate link. If it's from um, some other place, it's not. So just so you're warned of that, I do use affiliate links. Um, basically just from Amazon, though. This is a Sinful Shine, and this is Blue by You. And it is a beautiful, naturally it's beautiful, it's blue. Um, I don't know how to describe the color, so just look at it. It's a beautiful shimmery, very shimmery blue. So here is the first coat of Blue by You.
I needed swatch wheels and they came yesterday. Well, not yesterday because yesterday would have been the second, but I'm filming this back in August. So today is August 15th. So August 14th, I finally received my swatch wheels. Okay, so there is one coat of Blue Bayou from Simple Shine. Next up is another China Glaze. I've had this one since it came out. I've never worn it. And I adore it. So I don't know why I didn't wear it. So this is Star Hopping by China Glaze. And it's a beautiful deep dark blue jelly base with, I believe there's blue glitter in there. And there's hollow glitter. And ugh, it's just beautiful. And with a matte top coat. Oh, you guys. If you don't own this, I highly recommend this one. It's beautiful. Okay, so here is one coat of China Glaze Star Hopping. I'm trying to get the focus to be right. Because it keeps going out of focus. Okay, so there's one coat of Star Hopping. beautiful and it's so opaque in one coat next up is a pure ice I don't think this is going to be available anymore and I do apologize it's pure ice and it's all night long and it's just a deep dark blue but it has like every now and then you can pick up a hint of green There it is on the brush. Very deep and dark. Okay, so here is one coat of all night long. I actually think it kind of has like a green shimmer in it and that's what gives it the green look to it. Because through the viewfinder it kind of looks green. But there is one coat of all night long Okay, and next is a glam polish, and I believe this is fairly new. I think it came out in August, and it's got a dusty quality to it. So this is Talk to the Hand from Glam, and it is. It's a dark, it's a dusty blue with, it looks like it's got those chameleon glitters in there and some scattered hollow. There it is on the brush. Okay. And here is one coat of Talk to the Hand from Glam on the swatch. This one you will need a good top coat for because those chameleon glitters are a little chunky. And it will leave a little feel to the polish. Okay, so that's one coat of Talk to the Hand. Um, Royal Navy does dry a little satin there. It seems like Holiday Madness, I must have it, and Gatsby does also. I'm going to pause, put on my second coat, and we'll be back. Okay, guys, so here we are. Let me get in a little closer for these. So here is Wet n Wild's I Must Have It. Then we have Barry L's Holiday Madness. This could probably stand another coat. So three coats for Holiday Madness. This is Gatsby by Broadway Nails. And you can still see how sure this is. So three, four coats. Or you can probably layer it over a similar color. Apple from Zoya is probably going to need three coats. But it's a very pretty sparkly green and then we have baroque jungle by china glaze and i bet if you did a thick enough coat it would be a one coater but that's just a beautiful deep dark green looks like it'll stain i don't know claire can chime in down below um if she doesn't have this in her video um 
because she wore it. She actually wore it. I don't know if it's stained or not. She didn't mention it to me, so. Next up is Orly's Blue by You with that beautiful turquoise shimmer shimmering right on through. Uh, Sinful Colors Blue by You will probably need another coat. So that would make that three coats, but it's a beautiful, vibrant blue. And then we have China Glaze Star Hopping, and you will need a good top coat or more than one because this will dry bumpy because of that glitter. But it, it is beautiful. And again, with a, a matte top coat on there, stunning. Next, we have Pure Ice All Night Long, which is also just beautiful. And then we have Glam's Talk to the Hand. And that is it. That is my five green and five blue picks for fall for Claire and I birthday collab. Um, what's on my nails again is <laughs> frostbite and then a glitter gradient of ILNP's Easy Street. You want to get a better picture of that go back to august on my instagram and you will see it um but yeah that is these are my choices for our birthday collab i hope you've enjoyed and if you came to me from her channel welcome i hope you subscribe i do um some haul videos, not as many as I'd like to do because I kind of get antsy and put the polishes away before I make the video. Um, mostly what I do is collabs and collection videos, my collection, um, which I need to get a move on because I'm scheduled out to August, or I'm sorry, October. And with it being the 15th of August at the moment, I'm kind of cutting it short here so I need to get some more videos uploaded but I thank you guys and I hope you all have a great rest of your day and um, I hope to see your comments let me know which one of these is your favorite green and your favorite blue um, and if you have any suggestions for either color thanks talk to you later bye